Yeah, it's a great season. And I'm just, just uh, sad to let it go to waste like this. How um, much does this hurt right now? It hurt real bad. I mean, all the effort we put in over the season for the kind of lose this far. It's the first time you've ever cried after a basketball game? Yeah, it is. I mean, for Patrick, uh, this is his last, last year, the last time this team will ever be together. What so, happened tonight? Uh, I think they just outplayed us. Uh, they're, a, they're a real good team. They played they play hard for 40 minutes, and I think they outplayed us the whole game. Were you shocked? No, yeah, I was because uh, after I got to the, the three five, uh, the two fouls in the first, I had to sit down, and I was kind of frustrated because I wanted to help my team. What happened to the shooting tonight from downtown? I mean, everybody, everybody was going to have a great game. She was continuing from our outside playing because they did. I mean, half their shots came from threes. Were you guys starting to get frustrated when they started hitting threes? Uh, yes, sir, we kind of did. Uh, we just had to calm down a little bit, but it, it didn't help. What do you do now? Hmm? What do you do now? I don't know. We just, we just in the moment right now. We just gonna, just gonna wait. Is this thing going to bother you for a long time? Yeah, it is. I mean, this is the uh, last time we're going to be uh, on the. Uh, Team for the time of the players. How, uh, how much uh, satisfaction do you get from the season? Uh, you guys won 35 games and did a lot that people didn't think you could do. I mean, we get a lot of satisfaction from it. I mean, especially for uh, each other, our uh, coach. He really helped us out to be our uh, come in. So I think we're going to get a lot of satisfaction out of that in life. Did you feel like you guys had good three pointers and they just weren't going? Or did yeah, we we felt like we had, we had a lot of good three-pointers, but they started falling at the end when Darnell started making the call. What about the play of Missoula in there? I mean, the guy hasn't shown that good a ball handling maybe all year and has a really big game against I you mean, guys. He just, he, he wanted to win. Uh, I guess that's what happened. He wanted to win real bad. Uh, he just stepped his game up. Eric, what, played us. So what happened with the two early fouls on you? Uh, I was just trying to cut them off, man. I guess the ref called blocking me and I jumped uh, over the screen, and I guess that's what it what, that's what it was. Eric, there's several you guys are going to have to ask about whether you're going to consider trying the NBA or not. No, I'm just worried. I'm just uh, in the moment right now, worried about all that. Would winning tonight have influenced your decision at all? Is falling short of the Final Four going to weigh into your decision any? Yeah, yes, yeah. Uh, because I really, I really want to win me in that championship. And I don't know where, where I might come back or I might stay. But as of right now, I'm just focused on, on this moment we, we're all into. Eric, what will you remember the most from this season? Was there a specific game? Was it the teammates? It's just a terrific team. We, uh, it came together. Uh, everybody came together as brothers. And I ain't, I ain't never seen a team like that uh, so talented uh, without too many egos coming together as one. Yeah, I guess we did that. How did West Virginia, Eric, compare to the teams you guys have played so far this year? Uh, they, they, they play hard. Uh, they play, they athletic. They athletic uh, as any team we played this year. And they just came out and you know, played us from uh, start to finish. Eric, no matter what you decide to do, do you expect this team to look a lot different next year? Uh, yeah, I think it, I'm thinking it is because uh, everybody got options to go pro uh, to stay. But I don't think this team will ever be like like the team we had this season.